Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a custom HP. Just like that. Actually, this shouldn't be 150. I don't know why I put 150. It should be 165. And, but, yeah. And this overshield is, for some reason, on. For these. But, anyway. Yeah. Let's get right into it. So, now, what we're going to do. I don't know. So, what we're going to need is a class selector, class designer, a button, a switch, and a billboard, if you guys want to. So, I'll make this from scratch on this side, um, but then I'll go over the settings from over there. So, we're going to grab ourselves a button. We're going to grab ourselves a switch. We're going to grab a class selector and a class designer and we're also going to get a billboard so uh, what we're gonna do first we're gonna place the class selector right there um, class to switch to is gonna be one Ta uh, team to switch to that you guys don't have to touch the uh, size of volume is gonna be 0.5 off 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 and that is that next we're going to place the class designer put on the floor and the settings for this are going to be class identifier is one um and max health is going to be 100 and max shield is going to be whatever you guys like for example, I'm just going to put 75. And you guys don't have to touch any of this. Next, we guys are going to do You guys are going to have a button and a switch. So, you can move those two like that. The settings for the switch are going to be uh, visible during game, yes. Initial state off, all this. Uh, this is going to be toggle switch. Disable the sound. We're going to disable the interaction. And that is that. For the button, the settings are going to be interaction time 0.5. Um, visible during game is going to be no. And interaction radius is going to be 0.5. The settings for the button, uh, we're going to go over here. So... If you, um, don't put them together like this over here until I show you guys these settings. So for the button, you're going to have on interact set events to switch for, turn on, and force, or whatever your switch is. Um, for the switch, make sure turn on when receiving from button, and turn off when receiving from those other switches that you have for your other custom healths. For this, you're going to put on turned on 10 events to switch number 5, or for me it's number 5, switch number 6 off, and on turned on 10 events to class selector, change player to class. Those are the settings, so um, we can just delete this over here. Oh. Uh, next, you guys are going to want to grab a billboard. The settings are you guys are going to want whatever your HP is, centered, 24, white, Burbank, Robo, or Noto Sans, whatever you guys like. Outline is going to be thick, and shadow is going to be lower right. Well, that's how I have mine. And that should be it for the custom health. So now if we start the game. One... We walked over here. 75. 150. 200. And then you guys can go back to all of these. And as you guys can see, it turns off that other switch when done. And I'm not activating the switch. I am interacting with the button. But it's just like that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys have any questions, please leave them down below in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.